These two little egg eggs saying alone. Looking like Muppets. <laughs> it's 5.45. We're getting up. It's a beautiful 5.45. The sun rises in like 10 minutes, I think. It's about to get... It's about to get good. Mm -hmm. A little bit of a climb. It's like... We started at 6. I have 10 miles we're doing today. But only one big climb. It sucks to be going uphill with water weight from the tent and extra water because there's no water on this stretch. And then not be out of breath but not be able to breathe because we're flatlanders. That sucks. Yeah, it's the best of all worlds. <laughs> I assume that's our ridge because it's glowing. I think that's the false summit of the ridge. Unfortunately. Well, like, that's the ridge we're going towards, whether it be false or not. Yeah. So, we're going through a burn zone. So there's a lot of fallen trees, slightly charred. Hence the intense water carry. <sighs> and also, hence the first thing in the morning, so <laughs> we get there before it the middle of the day. Yeah. This is probably the campsite that eight people headed out to at 4 p.m. yesterday. The infamous campsite. Beautiful. Oof. I need breakfast. Finish getting up this hill. I'm gonna throw back a goo as well. Finished getting up this mountain. <laughs> How you feeling? I feel great. We got three miles deep so far today. Mm hmm. Pretty quick. Pretty nice. This climb is brought to you by Big Sur Bar. Huh. Also, pro tip on trail, especially in the morning, if you see a pack with no human next to it, they are pooping in the woods. Look down and keep going. Give them their privacy. Did hmm? you pass that? There was a. That well, woman, that girl, she had two backpacks. She had two backpacks, yeah. yeah. That's when you just, you know, look, Ooh, look down. Somebody pooping. Probably had a childish. great time. Just get real childish. Probably had a great time. They're like, you know what? It's a great morning. Oh. Boop. Boop. Lots of pebbles. I have no idea. Like falling trees? Guess we'll find out. Are birds gonna be dropping stuff on us? Bird bombs! Are we under attack? Maybe. I think we're gonna be under attack. <laughs> we're halfway through our planned day and it's nine o'clock. And it's only nine. Good job. <sighs> Sunscreen. Oh, I gotta do that. Letting this dry out because it's so wet. Might go explore over there, yeah? I'm gonna get on top of those rocks for sure. <laughs> A wild will. On a rock. I just had to do it. No, that's not the way. I know. I'm okay. not going up. I just had to do a big, like, kind of mantle, like, big step up.
He's on a sketchy rock. I don't want to go to. You guys, there's so many wildflowers that are blooming right now. Oh, it just makes my little my little heart so happy because they're so small and delicate, but they're so pretty. Look at them. I really like these wildflowers. Mm. Starting to get a little bit, I can't even talk. Starting to get a little bit more epic. Like, I don't know. Boop. Nice. Ooh. More flowers. More flowers. Flowers. Oh, my head's in the way. Is it focusing? Yeah. Can I just say how nice it is just to be able to look up and see what's around me and just enjoy it? Because I don't have to worry about rocks and roots. <laughs> it's amazing. It's like, wow, I get to take it all in. <laughs> also, I forgot how awkward I am on trail. So, apparently, Will and I started during the popular time to do the Colorado Trail, because there's giant groups. There's like 10 or 12 people in these little baby tent sites. <sighs> Some of them are really cool. We've had cool little rest hangout conversations as I awkwardly walk up on this other couple taking a break. <laughs> I'm so awkward, it hurts. I'm catching up to people. This is a pretty, pretty awesome section of trail here. Absolutely loving this burn zone. It's just so much beauty in the, the new life coming up. Just saw a mama mule deer and her kid over here jumping over the ridge line. That's been awesome. It's like a little robot. I gotta do the necessary evil and put some tape on some hot spots. I think that building is where I'm going. <coughs> Almost busted it. I would like to go 100 days without falling. Not 100 days, 100 miles. Oh my god. Just look at the pretty. Oh, where'd the husky go? Road again. There's your little campsite. Small leaf pussy toes. And found a flower called what? That one is spreading dog bane. Got some more mullen. That's uh, some kind of sagebrush. Well, if we didn't breathe, it'd probably come over. No, they get really close to you when you just don't do anything for a while. We just did some yoga. Just some green yoga. And some pressure point stuff. I guess what you call it. Sure, yeah, acupressure. Acupressure thingies. <sighs> So we're very relaxed, and now I'm tired. And I'm about to eat third lunch. It's 4.30. I think it's technically dinner. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so instead of doing two days to 
go 12.6 miles. Which is ridiculous when you think about it. We're going to do it tomorrow. Spam soy sauce ramen with Buddy's added in wasabi, wasabi seaweed. seaweed. Oh my gosh. Now that is luxury. On the other note, I am burned to a crisp. And I think my top lip is swollen. I think I got burnt. I'm super tired because I'm burnt. I'm not as tired today as I was yesterday. About this time yesterday, I was ready. I was about in the same shape. Not ready to go to sleep. Me. Try to brush with the left hand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I hit a lot harder. Mm -hmm. Mm. We're waiting for the sun to go down. But he's reading, but he also cut himself with a rack. No, a branch. No, a tent stick. Mm. Which is even more embarrassing. <laughs> We're gonna go to bed soon. I'm burnt and tired. <laughs>